Today I want to share with you the reason why 99% of men fail. The reason they fail comes down to one single word, goals. People don't have goals. They don't know where they're going. They don't know what they want. They wake up like accident. They wake up with no purpose. They wake up with no sense of direction. They don't know what they want. They don't know who they want. They don't know who they are. So today I want to talk to you about goals. Now, goals are very much like archery. In order for you to hit the target, you must first have a target. So the first step in goal setting is your ability to determine where you will shoot. The second variable is you have to aim. You need to understand that having a goal alone is not enough. You need to make a concise plan. You need to take into account the wind. You need to take into account the humidity, the distance, the different things that are in your way in order for you to hit your goal. Once you've calculated all the different variables that it takes and you begin to understand the nature of achieving this goal, because you don't just go and, you know, not aim and look at a target and just shoot. That's not how it works. You need to be able to aim. And then finally, as previously mentioned, you have to have the ability to shoot. This means you have to have the intention of taking action. Having a goal, understanding the nature of the goal and the things necessary to accomplish the goal mean nothing without shooting, without taking action. If you want to become successful in your life, you have to be able to understand your goal, have a goal, understand the variables in the nature of achieving this goal, of hitting the target. And then finally, you have to shoot. You have to take action. You have to be the decision maker. And you have to understand that whether you hit the target or not, that you are responsible alone for that shot. Nobody else is responsible for you. Now, there's a big reason why people don't want to establish goals. It's because they have a history of missing. And the reason they have a history of missing is because they don't understand how to aim. They don't understand how to research, how to think. They don't understand how to be a person that is perspicacious enough to perceive the things around them in such a way whereby they can figure out how to accomplish the mission of hitting the target. And then finally, most people don't take action. They fantasize about their goals. They fantasize about their dreams. They fantasize. Some of them know all the research. Look at all these academics. You know, they know so much. They understand the nature of this, how to execute this. But a lot of people don't do. You have to be able to shoot. You have to be able to take action. This is the nature of goal setting. This is the nature of accomplishing the things that you want to accomplish. In life, if you can do these three things, you can achieve whatever it is that you set your mind to. And ultimately, the goal is what? To hit the bullseye. The goal is to be precise. The goal is to achieve the desired result in the desired time frame, in the desired fashion. And all of this is refined through iteration, training, your ability to train, your ability to set your goal, accomplish your goal by aiming and by working hard towards it. This idea that you can pull out your bow and arrow in the first try, <laughs> look at the target, that you'll understand all the variables and that you'll shoot and that you'll hit a bullseye in the first time is just ridiculous. It makes no sense. It's never worked in the past and it'll never work again. Iteration, consistency, progress towards that ordeal, towards hitting the bullseye, whatever that may be, requires time, requires dedication, and it requires consistency. Now, consistency doesn't care about how you feel. It doesn't care about the conditions of the terrain. It doesn't care whether you feel like shooting or not shooting. Consistency dictates that you must go through these three steps every single time, every single day, in order to shoot and continue practicing towards accomplishing the bullseye. So in conclusion, in life, if you want to be successful, you need to know where you're going, by understanding what you want and understanding who you are. You need to aim, understand the nature of your goal, where you wanna go, how you wanna live, the difficulties and the opportunities that come by achieving that goal. And then finally, you have to shoot. You have to execute. Talking is not enough. You must do. Now, most people fear the repercussions of doing because they're fully accountable and responsible. But if you want to succeed in life and you want to be in control, and you want to be the decision maker, and you want to live life on your own terms, then this is what it requires. But if you want to be an Olympian, you have to train. You have to be consistent. You have to understand that it's going to require iteration. It's going to require for you to go to different terrains time and time again, time and time again, whether you like it or not. And that is the key to accomplishing anything in life, to accomplishing your goals, to hitting the bullseye.